any great story, you have really strong characters that you care about, and this has so many characters that you care about, and uh, you know, it's it's good people overcoming evil, you know, and, and I think that's a big part of it. Oh, I just got to do some really fun tree climbing stuff, and I got to do a lot of training, climbing up trees as fast as I could, and I had a custom made harness, so it was really fun. He's such a physical character, and he's he's larger than life, and. Um, he is definitely one of the tributes that's favored to win the games, but um, inside he's really terrified. He's terrified like all these other kids. He is not a career. He didn't train to do this his whole life, and he's forced to do it. And, you know, he, he's, he's a gentle giant. But at the same time, if he's pushing the corner, you know, he'll kick some ass. We wanted to ask you guys, if the two of you were engaged in a battle to the death in person, like between you guys, who would win? Levin. I'd win. You would. I'd kick his ass. You would. <laughs> He would. She's, she's the fiercest person I know. So for my audition, I got all dressed up as Rue. I had mud all over my clothes, and there were twigs and leaves in my hair. And I was like, I'm going to get this. So I dressed up just like Rue. When I got the phone call, it was about 7.30 in the morning, and Gary Ross had called me. And I, I didn't answer the phone call because I, I didn't realize it was him. I think I was more in shock for a few days uh, before I celebrated. We had a lot of pranksters and comedians. On, on set. Everyone was pranking each other and Jack was always making us laugh at really inappropriate times. One of the challenging scenes to shoot was uh, when we were doing the corner focus scene and we had to like just be in this get ready position, like get ready to go. And we would wait there for like 60 seconds and like your back, like we started having back spasms and stuff. We had a week where we shot the reaping scenes and it was about 100 degrees or higher and we had extras fainting on set. It was pretty tough. It was very difficult. I really enjoyed shooting the bow and arrow, and I actually got kind of good at it, I think. I actually didn't learn how to do it until I got onto the set about an hour before my scene. I just had to make sure that I was very safe and didn't actually shoot Jennifer down from the tree. A personal talent, I could beatbox. I'm kind of nice with that, but I don't know how that'll save me in the arena. Nice. Congratulations to all the Campus Movie Fest filmmakers. I got that. Congratulations, you guys are awesome. Ten, nine, eight, seven.